Hi everybody, this presentation is called Povidone Iodine. It's part of a surgical prep series. And just so everyone knows, Povidone Iodine is frequently referred to as Betadine in the operating room. If you're working in an operating room, it's important to know the difference between Betadine paint or prep and Betadine soap or scrub. We use these paint and prep and soap and scrub interchangeably. Everybody kind of mixes the lingo up, but you need to know the difference. So let's talk about it. Starting with Betadine paint or Betadine prep, that's a 10% solution and it will be labeled as prep or paint. This is the solution you use on skin just prior to incision. If you're prepping with Betadine, this step is mandatory. Betadine paint is safe to use on delicate tissue, mucosal membranes, open wounds and infected wounds. You will literally be painting this onto your surgical site. I hope to make a video on prepping technique in the near future. Let me know in the comments if you're interested in seeing this. Now let's talk about Betadine scrub or Betadine soap. Betadine scrub is a 7.5% solution and it's actually a mix of soap and Betadine or it's like a detergent and Betadine. Using Betadine scrub, it's optional, but I would, I would recommend it for closed intact skin free of mucosal membranes. And the goal with using this solution is to scrub the skin to mechanically remove oils and dirt from the skin. After you've scrubbed the skin, you're going to blot it dry with a sterile towel to remove as much of the scrub as possible. And then you'll follow with the Betadine paint. So I hope this gives you a better understanding between the differences between Betadine scrub and Betadine prep. Please remember to examine and read bottles before using these solutions because they look the same, but there are distinct differences between the two of them and they're not the same.